Hey, it's James Taylor here from Music Business Institute. I'm really fortunate to be in a beautiful part of the world this week. I'm in Santa Barbara um, in Southern California, and I'm with Brian Bargell, um, who is a longtime trainer in Entreport. Um, you, you've been with this, this business for quite some time when, you, when it really first got, got started. And I'm here at a training course learning all about marketing automation. I want to film this really quick video um, primarily for my uh, music business kit students, really just to give you a bit of an, a take on what marketing automation is and entrepreneur and why you might want to have a look at it in marketing automation in general. So first of all, Brian, thank you for yeah. doing this interview. Thanks, James. I'm really glad you asked me to talk today. It's great. And yeah. so we're on day four of this, this course. Uh, mm -hmm. I think my brain is about bursting. And my way. throat is about to burst <laughs> as well. <laughs> so. I've been talking for about four days straight, so I'm glad to, we'll be glad to have a break pretty soon. No, it's great. So. Yeah. First of all, what is marketing automation? So marketing automation, I think that for people who aren't familiar with it, it's best to describe it in terms of what it's not. Okay. So we think about traditional marketing, we try and think about brand marketing, uh, a lot of advertisements that people pay money for, yeah. um, you know, magazines or coupon clippers, things like that. The idea is to spread the message out in a very broad sense, a very uh, wide sense. Yeah. Uh, marketing automation uh, basically is a set of tools that you use to do what's called direct response marketing. Okay. And direct response marketing has a lot to do with people out there looking for information. People are looking for information on, on Google, on Facebook, things like that. And really direct uh, marketing allows you to respond to what people are looking for. So if someone's looking for how to play the drums or how to learn how to play the piano, where do they go? They go to places like uh, ask.com or Bing or Google, they'll type in that search. And then marketing automation allows you to respond to their requests for information from you. Uh, in a way that doesn't require your time. So you set these systems up in advance using tools like Entreport to deliver the information, the experience you want to people that allows you to spend the time doing what you love to do. So instead of sending out emails and reminders to people about lessons or uh, promotions about a gig coming up, you set all those things up in advance yeah. and then it just happens while you're away a holiday or at the gig or touring or whatever it is. Awesome. Um, and uh, probably a lot of people here that may be using MailChimp or Aweber or kind of e traditional email marketing services. So um, and I was with someone last week who really has 95% of business automated using something like Entreport though. So how does Entreport differ from maybe those traditional maybe email marketing type services that are out there? That's a really good question. So there are great email marketing services out there, Aweber, MailChimp. Those are mainly list-based services. And what they do is they just deliver emails to people on a regular schedule. The challenge is that you might have three or four different lists and three or four different forms that people filled out. And people can be on those lists and you don't really know which list they're on. Yeah. So Entreport is a database-driven system, which means that everything about that contact is in one place. So you know that they're on the different lists you've got on Entreport. Mm. As well, Entreport does so much more than just send out email. It allows you to sell products online, track advertising dollars, create tasks for people to do things if you're setting up for a tour or a live event. So it really takes all the tools you might want for managing your online business and wraps it into one package. Oh, wow. I mean, so it sounds like a lot of those services that maybe musicians are already using, you know, they, they've got their shopping, might have a shopping cart selling their t-shirts and their CDs and the downloads. They might have an you know, email marketing system of some sort. But it's quite quite fragmented, so it sounds like Entreport kind of brings it all together in one place. Absolutely right. So you have the chance to have one login to control all those parts of your system. And then when you have the system talking to itself, that is all the parts of your system are in one roof, yeah. you really have a lot of advantages. For example, if you know somebody uh, went to a gig in a particular spot, mm. you can target them as living in that area. So the next time you come around, you're promoting that gig right there. Whereas, you know, with a MailChimp, if they just get on your mailing list, you're telling them about all the gigs, yeah. not just the gigs in Southampton or Liverpool or wherever you are. Yeah. And I love the fact that you do, that the Entrepreneur does a lot of, almost like old school offline stuff, which we kind of tend to forget with a lot of the online. So, um, you know, one of the use cases I was seeing was if someone lives in a certain area, um, you, you can send them a postcard when you're going to be in forming in that area, you can really kind of reduce that, and that's all ultimately as well. Absolutely. So you just need to know where they live, so their postcode or the city they live in, and you can create different uh, segments of your database to target those people, write the right message at the right time for them. Awesome. 
So what other kind of uses do you think, you know, someone, let's say if I'm a musician or maybe, you know, maybe I'm a writer, an author, what kind of uses could you see them using for something like Entreport? So Entreport is such an awesome tool, you can use it for so many things. So for example, uh, if you're an author, you can use it to create a list or some buzz around your book. You can use it to have people sign up for the list and then deliver them a free chapter in advance of the book. Uh, give them rewards or even pre-sell the book uh, right there on your own website. Yeah. Uh, as well, if you're an author, you might want to have a course that's associated with your book or product. Mm. Uh, if, you're, if you're a musician, you can if you do in-person lessons, you can send people reminders via SMS or by email. Uh, you can also record your courses and have Entreport drip out the information to those courses by people via email, and you can create a membership site. So there's so many things you can do with a tool like Entreport. Fantastic. For those folks. And the reporting, from what I've seen, the reporting is really pretty clear, you know, clear that you can see, you know, if I'm doing some Facebook ads to promote my new album or a tour, you can see it tracking right back to, well, how much money did I make? You know, how many tickets did I sell? How many downloads did I sell from this thing as well? So there's a lot of reporting power there. There is, and that's the advantage of having everything in an all-in-one system. So if you are tracking from the lead source, whether it came in from Facebook or Google Ads or even a friend of yours, uh, told them about you, yeah. you can track that all the way to the purchase. So you know which channels are delivering value for you so you're not wasting money spending on ads that aren't working. Great. So I'm going to put a link just down here uh, below this video uh, so you can find out more about Entreport. Where can they find out more about yourself as well? You know, so for me, they can go to brianbargell.com, uh, just kind of get my website started there. And uh, definitely talk to James. And if I have more stuff that I would like to share, or he'd like me to share with you, I'll be glad to be available. Awesome. Thanks, Brian. And thanks yeah. for spending time with this beautiful campus here at Entreport. Thank you. It's lovely. Great.